Hi subscribers. Um so uh ABC let me down. That's fine. I didn't get to show people what anxiety feels like. And they told me they would. That's fine. I'm trying so hard. I talked to that lady for months. Months. I talked to that lady trying to tell what panic attacks feel like. What anxiety attacks feel like. They were more worried about the phobias than anything else. They showed a clip of mine for two seconds. Maybe one second, maybe one and a half. But they didn't even talk about the anxiety attacks, really. They talked about the phobias, but they didn't talk about the panic attacks. Subscribers, I'm sorry. I got your hopes up, and maybe I shouldn't have. I got my own hopes up, and maybe I shouldn't have. The lady came all the way to Los Angeles, California, just to interview me. I guess I wasn't crazy enough. I have phobias too. I wasn't crazy enough, I guess. I tried so hard to, to help people with anxiety. I'm sorry guys, only hot females get to go play on the part of ABC. They didn't show any males. They showed females with problems. They didn't show any males. They showed me for two seconds. Didn't even splash my YouTube channel. They didn't do anything like that. No one with mental illness is not going to find my video. It's just going to be the same thing forever. I was so excited. I hope they were going to at least do 30 seconds to a minute. Just to show what a panic attack looks like. Just to show what it actually looks like. As I've been trying to show people without anxiety disorder. What an anxiety attack feels and looks like. Unfortunately, that never happened. They didn't show what an actual panic attack looked like. They only showed the phobias. I was, I tried so hard, so hard to get the video shown more so people like us with anxiety disorders and with schizophrenia and bipolar would be taken more seriously. And ABC let me down. I can't believe it. I tried so hard. I tried so hard for my subscribers to hit a better audience so I could possibly get help. Like that lady did with the phobias of the hair pulling. She got help. And I did it. Because of ABC. She got help. And I didn't. So I'm not able to share how to get better from anxiety. I tried so hard to become a bigger subscriber. Obviously, I don't know how to edit videos properly. It hurts me a lot because I tried so hard. I tried so hard to get a better audience. <laughs> So maybe that one day a doctor would see it, it, you know, take me seriously about the anxiety attacks. And that didn't happen. They're worried about the hair pulling phobia and the vomiting phobia. But they don't know about the other phobias that people suffer with. They didn't take it seriously. They should have took it seriously because I wasn't faking during those panic attacks and anxiety attacks. I wasn't faking. 
I know people with anxiety. A lot of people suffer from it and no one helps. No one helps. No one helps. I tried so hard to help people. And no one helps. All they do is medicate you. And that lady got therapy for free. Because her her channel went viral because of their hair pulling phobia. I would have loved to receive some help too. I would have loved it. Unfortunately, no. I tried so hard to show people what actual anxiety attacks look like. They had my videos and they could have shown it. There was other people who had anxiety and panic attacks too. There was other people out there that were having it too. They could have showed theirs. And they didn't. They didn't show what it feels like to have one. Now, once again, I got to start from scratch zero. I got to start from scratch zero again. Because there's millions of people out there with anxiety and phobias, yes. But straight line anxiety and straight line panic attacks are not fun. And those are some of the scariest things on earth. Even worse than hair pulling. Because it feels like you're going to die. I'm sorry, subscribers. I didn't know that they were just going to show two seconds and then run away. I thought they were going to show more about panic attacks. They, they even keyworded panic attacks. They didn't show anything about panic attacks. They showed like 10 seconds of high blood pressure and... And a high pulse rate. That was it. They didn't show anything deep into it. They didn't explain it. They didn't have a doctor explain what a panic attack is. They didn't show example videos. I am so sorry subs that suffer from anxiety. It's not fair. If I, had, if I was rich though, I would have it out there. I would have it out there. I'd have all people's YouTube channels that suffer from anxiety out there. Unfortunately, the media only cares about the phobias. I'm so sorry, guys. I thought they were going to show more. They showed two seconds, and they didn't even splash my YouTube channel. Nobody would know who I was. They're not even going to find my channel. I mean, they're not even going to They're not even gonna look for it. You know? I mean, they're going to look for it, but they're not going to find me. They have a two-second clip of me having one of my anxiety attacks or panic attacks, whichever one it was, and... It, it's just not going to be shown. It's not going to be seen by anybody. So for all you non-anxiety sufferers out there. I don't know what to tell you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry to everybody on my subscribers channel. I tried so hard to get more, more people to understand what anxiety feels like. I tried so hard. And I failed. Because ABC doesn't care. No one cares about us. No one cares. They just want to shove pills down our throat. But they don't want to get to the root of it. And they just had to talk about the ladies with the uh, frontal lobe uh, hypersexual thing. I actually thought that was funny. But sad. But they didn't talk about anxiety. Not very much. They didn't actually talk about anxiety disorders. They just said anxiety disorders. But they didn't say They didn't go into it. I tried so hard, guys. I'm sorry. I am so, like, just deep and sad, man. It's like, not depressed. I'm just upset. Like, it's like, you work all this way and you talk for that lady for months and she comes and interviews you and, and nothing transpires. Once again, for the sixth time, I have been thrown on the bus for the sixth time. I hope one day somebody will actually interview me or interview somebody with panic attacks and actually show the whole video on what it feels like to have a panic attack. I am so sorry, subscribers. They don't care.
I'm so sorry. All those people that have mental illness, anxiety, bipolar, depression, I'm so sorry, guys. They don't care about us. They don't care. They only want to show the negative aspects of it. They don't want to show any positives. They don't want to show if there's any help for it. They don't want to do anything. I apologize. Looks like the pharmaceutical companies win for the millionth time. I'm actually heartbroken right now. I almost feel like when my uncle died. That's how I feel. Just a shot in the heart. Thank you guys for watching.